There are some times when you do transactions on the blockchain and some of these end up being stuck. In this video, I'll show you how you can unstuck a transaction on the Phantom network. This is similar for other networks as well as I did this for the Avalanche network, the same steps in order to unlock this. Hey friends, Pedro here. Let's dive in. So you need to be in your MetaMask wallet, of course. Now you need to go here, click on your profile and go to the settings. Here in the settings, you need to go to advanced and here you want to scroll down until you see this right here customize transaction nonce and you need to have this on now you don't need to click on save or anything else just click on this x and you are back and now if you are checking if you go back and recheck that you see that this is on right all right after you did that you need to click on the transaction you got right here and see the details in my case you see this is a transaction that actually went through i don't have a transaction that failed or that is stuck and we'll use this one but it's the same procedure this does not really matter it looks the same way so when you click on a transaction you should be able to see this nonce right here and it's very important to remember or note down this number right here 58 in my case right so let's assume that this transaction was not confirmed and is stuck and for me it happened to be stuck for a few hours and sometimes that happens maybe you are approving twice the same transaction and it gets stuck i don't really know if this is the only reason but this is what happened for me i was uh, hurrying up and i did one transaction and i quickly went on with the next one and it got stuck okay now that you wrote down this number right here 58 right let's remember 58 now you what you need to do is to be sure to be in the wallet you want to unstuck course in my case phantom and here click on send and but before that copy your wallet address right here just click here and you copy this you need to send zero ftms to your wallet address and that will unstuck this transaction but you need to use the nonce from that transaction right there so click on send and now paste your wallet address and here leave it zero don't change so this won't cost anything and now click on next right so leave everything as it is right here you don't need to change anything click on next and here you need to type in the nonce you have on the transaction that it's stuck. In my case, I was looking at the transaction, the nonce was 58, right? And after that, you just confirm this and save it. You confirm this and the transaction should go through and unstuck the other one. And after that, you can just go on and do the transaction you want to do again. Now, assuming you have enough Phantom in your wallet, there are the same exact steps to follow also for Avalanche network or for other networks, just that you need to be in your Avalanche network. For example, this is for Avalanche right so it's very very straightforward and easy to do this i hope this was helpful thank you for watching and see you around friends bye bye